To me, it's now a lock that the Steelers are drafting either Parker Washington or Jaden Reed in the third round. Somebody like that because you can't just have Calvin Austin in the slot and absolutely no depth. And you don't even know if Calvin Austin can hold up during a 17-game season. My concerns aren't with his play because I've seen him burn Steelers players in training camp. I know his talent level, but again, you still have to see him play. That's not my concern, though. My concern, though, is, is he going to get injured? Okay, Kenny Pickett has a huge year coming up. You shouldn't even have to ask the question of, uh, are we good at slot wide receiver? Do everything in your power to get him the most weapons possible. And this is a situation where you clearly need another slot wide receiver. And a guy like Parker Washington or Jaden Reed, like I said, would be perfect. But you simply cannot come into the season with three good guys. You got to have four good guys. You got to have, you know, as many as possible. But you also have Pat Farmu, so there's not too much concern or anything like that. You would just need to show Kenny Pickett that every single corner has been covered with this offense. Again, this is simply just making sure that no stone goes unturned because Kenny Pickett is the make or break of this team and he's going into the most important year when it comes to football for him. So you just want to have everything down pack and make sure you don't got to worry about, oh, what if this guy goes down? You never want to be one injury away because there's never been a team that's won a Super Bowl when they're one injury away. And I don't really think that, you know, you have to stress about spending a third round pick on a wide receiver and the talent's so good nowadays you're going to get a really good wide receiver in the third round this team really does not have that many issues as well at least in my opinion none major none popping out again it's just can Kenny Pickett take this team to the promised land I believe that he can but you're going to need to do everything in your power to support him and this is just one of those transactions that you got to make and it's pretty simple the Steelers are going to take a wide receiver in the third or fourth round I wouldn't say the last second round pick I think that might be a stretch but if they do it I won't be surprised but let me know what y'all think about Steven Sims leaving and where the Steelers should pick wide receiver in the draft if they should at all hopefully y'all enjoyed this video though and that is it for me on this one peace